Hello, gorgeous ladies and gentlemen of the realm. Perry Vixen here, back again with another empty bin. We'll fill that in a minute. Let me empty this one. Because I never prepare fully. You know that, right? Okay. And here we go. We're going to be still working on this metal box here. Box number, what is it? Box number six, I think. That's a good start. We have the Rampage. Why, whatever would that? Ooh, that's pretty. Rampage. Oh, and I'm back to the oak table. I have to wash my, uh, I have to wash me thingy. And that's in the way. All right. Rampage is from what store? doesn't say on the back, but it retailed for $12, and it's this kind of little, little bitty stations, and then there's the roses, and then it goes down to these two little drops, and I think it's adorable. Isn't that cute? Look. I love it. Rampage. Rampage. Alright. Yes, it's getting cool where I am, so I'm wearing my sweater. And we have our green, or green, green! You know why I said green? Because I really wish my camera would like green because I got this awesome green nail polish that I want to try. So, thinking one thing and doing another is never good for you. Uh, yeah, so I busted out all the orange jewelry. And then, and then I, I, I got this one to go with the middle. And that's the jewelry of the day. Okay. Alright, what do we got? We got a filthy snaily chain. Ooh, that is dirty. It could be good dirt, though. It could be tarnish on silver. But we won't know until we test it. Testing, testing, that goes in the pile for Tuesday. Yes, that's a new thing with me, testing Tuesdays. I'll be testing everything that I find and then some each week on Tuesdays. Um, I'm going to post in the afternoon for that, if I can. Uh, yeah, because, um, yeah, let, 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 let me just, let me just... Show ya. This is all sterling, supposedly. A full one of these guys. So it's gonna be, we're gonna have, we're gonna have testing Tuesdays for quite some time. Um, yeah. And there is a very bright gold tone chain with a very dull spring ring. So that might have been, uh, replaced at some point, I would think. Oh boy, lots and lots of chains. <laughs> uh, ooh, hey, I know what this is. I've seen this before. This is KJL. I know this belongs. Yes! It's another KJL. I don't know the price point for this one, but it's not going to be my normal pricing. That's for sure. Look, it's one of these. It's one of the enamel, big enamel chains of his. Yep. Come on. There we go. Flip around. And it's in this lovely burgundy color. Am I down too far or what? No, I'm... I'm not, I'm, that's as far out as I'm getting, I guess, unless I raise it up just a hair. 
But then that always makes it tippy. Tippy, tippy. But yes, that is a beautiful... It's coming up much more purple on the camera. It's like a red purple. It's like a burgundy. It's a garnet color. And here's the little taggy waggy. That says da 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 KJ. It doesn't look like it wants to focus. Focus. There you go, KJL. Kenneth J. Lane for the uninitiated. It's a, it's a good one. We're going to have fun with that. I'm trying to figure out who gets it. Ooh, here's another one of these little tiny uh, choker guy. I have three of these in different colors. I have a cream color, now the black, and there's also a, a mint green one. Uh, so if anybody's interested in those, <laughs> I probably would throw them in if you want them. Oh wow, look at you. Screaming yellow! <laughs> It's a screaming yellow bracelet. It's almost uh, chartreuse, but it's coming up green on the camera, but it's a much brighter yellow than that. Um, here, let's turn the light on. That's more true to, true to color. I turned the light off because I get so much glare. Uh, it makes it difficult sometimes. Sometimes. Ooh, here's a very nice ring. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's like a morganite color. Well, it's gold tone, all right, and it's in great shape. There's no wear. It is a fashion ring. Yeah, and we have white rhinestone, morganite color, and is there any other? No, so it's just white rhinestones and morganite color. And it's really pretty. I really like it. It has nothing on the inside of it. And we're going to take a look at the size of it. It's larger than my finger, so it's an 8. And it's really, really pretty. I like it. Can I get it to focus on it? It's so sparkly that it's having trouble focusing. But I think you get the point. Pretty. Sp sparkly. You know how I like the sparkles. This is a piece of a stretchy bracelet that broke. So that will go into the craft lot. There we go. This one. Oh no. Oh, what are you? You're an owl and you are broken. Oh, wait, no. It's a pendant uh, without its jump ring. It's also got some wear right on the eyebrows. But it looks like it should be that way. I don't know why. And then it's got this weird stone. It isn't really a stone. So that looks like somebody's project. But it'll go for somebody else's project. You know? Was, that'll be great in, if you're doing a, like a Halloween, one of those... Um, jewelry pictures. You can put him in the tree. Ooh, I like this. It's one of these. One of these guys. It's, it's, uh, looks like it's not anything, but he heals the broken hearts. He heals the broken hearted. So, there you go. I think it's brass over copper, or gold tone over copper. It might clean up to a nice copper. That's 
nice. I like that. It's nice, nice little bitty one. This, uh, this is like the third piece of this that I found in here. The br I have the bracelet that is in perfect shape, but yeah, that's yeah. Oh, also want to let you guys know that I have a full medium flat rate box. Uh, it's lined with bubble wrap, but it is full to the top with craft. Um, yeah, my. Uh, my small flat rate um, craft boxes go for 15 and this medium that weighs about 20 pounds, see, yeah, it's real heavy. Um, and I'm going to be asking 25 plus shipping for it. So if you would like that box, please do say, whoever says it first in the comments, I will let have it. Uh <laughs> Pretty much, because I have so much that I have to get rid of. Oh, look. Oh, wait. Are you missing? It's missing its beads on that one. Oh, wait. Or is it? Maybe not, because it's got a couple like that. Come on. Don't do not do this tangly bone stuff. <laughs> oh, come on. Don't do it. Well, it looks like it wants to do it, so... See, now it was untangled a minute ago. Bleah. You go through here. Ah, look, I got it! Okay, so there's one without the beads. And then there's the beads. And the beads, and the not beads. And... Beads, beads, not beads. So, I'm not sure if it's just missing some or what it is not marked but it's in great condition other than that that might be easily fixed if you have the right kind of beads or if you want to switch out the beads here's one of these guys a very bright uh, rhinestones expansion bracelet the ones with this uh, this kind of a back um, and the metal in between are what I term expansion and not stretchy stretchy is just cord oh my gosh look at that I love it it's brass or copper. It's copper and black. It's a black heart. Which you know how I like the black hearts. I was wearing that other ring for a couple of days. And this is a seven and a half. So enamel. Cool. Very cool. Ooh, look, another ring. Ooh, you're pretty. And and these are in really great shape. Like this one. Nothing wrong with it. It's adjustable. It's red and silver tone. Oh, there is something wrong with it. It's missing one stone. Boo hoo. That goes into the craft lot because you can pop this piece off and use that in your artwork as well. Getting some good craft stuff out of here. So I'll be starting another craft box, another big one like that. Oh, here's a vintage chain. I remember my mama having a few of these big ropey chains. This one's a little bit worn or it needs washed real bad. Um, but I've noticed that this vintage gold tone is a little different than the gold tone now. Here's a twisty little Meshy bracelet. Cool. Small mesh and large mesh. And it says something on it that I cannot read without my loop. L B V Y R. L B V Y R. 
Whatever the heck that means. Does anyone know? I don't. I have a clue. Ooh. Are you a belt or are you a necklace? I don't know, but you got a chain stuck in you. There we go. I'm going to guess this is a belt. But the elements would make a lovely jewelry. Okay, so we have these really great hearts, gold tone, on a big chain, and the end is this guy, this textured heart, and yeah, it's a belt because it's got this big old thing. But, uh, yeah, you could definitely make some jewelry with these guys. So, I don't know if I'm going to put that in crafts or not. I do have a bag full of belts. I don't know if anybody's into them or not. There's a big, there's a big, uh, 80s ones. Or the little gold, you know, the little gold tone ones. Kind of like that. Here is a breast cancer bracelet. I believe it's an Avon. No, it's not. Or, uh, or is it? Yep. No, there's no mark on it. But Avon does make one very similar to this. Like a peachy pink with pink rhinestones. Alright, I think we have a multi strander going on here. Oh, look, it got wings. There's the middle of it. Haha, ha, I found you. Alright, so. Let's see. Huh! Let's not knock you over. We have a little golden medallion. Yeah. And then the next one is... Broken? Wait. Huh? Wolf? Uh, okay, this hangs on the side. It's one of those ones that has two that hang on the side. Oh, wait. No, they don't. Hold on. Hold the phone. This is one of them complicated ones. Alright, so. We have that. We have the wings. We have <coughs> this guy. this arrow and then I think these are a toggle just to make it even more complicated yes there you go <laughs> of course they had to make it more more complicated look it's a toggle or I guess you could wear it open with them hanging but that would be weird I mean to me, that would be weird. But it would be less of a pain in the butt than trying to get that done, I guess. I don't know. Right. What do we have here? We have a thing caught up in a thing. We have a thing and it's caught up in a thing. Thingy, thingy, thing. Ooh. So we won't be playing with that for a minute. We have um, another one of these. The ones that I put on my pendants when I don't have sterling. It's really a nice, uh, yeah. Ooh. Unless he's dos. Oh, look, it's little headphones. That's adorable. 
<laughs> I know somebody's gonna want this. If I can get it untangled. Okay, so. This is tangled up in it. <laughs> Let's get it untangled real quick. This can be undone and then pulled out. There we go. Okay, so this is this cute little, it's on a ribbon, but it can very easily be put on a, uh, on a chain with clasp. Hold on a minute. Yeah, there we go. Everything's going to be weird. I know. There's a feather and a heart and a quarter note, I forget. A star, a guitar, another heart with a, a, a musical note, a microphone, some headphones, and what's that last one? A G clef. Uh, don't fight, girls. Don't fight. You know how my stuff works. I always hit the show newest first so that we know who said what first. So, good luck. I know there's a couple people that are going to want that one. Oh, what are you? You were broken. It had a glass something and it is broken with a heart that says... Live justice. Okay, I'm gonna dismantle that so nobody gets cut on it. Here's a fun one with it's got the ribbon through it, but the ribbon is in really good shape and it feels heavy and it has. A tag. What's this tag? Gwen? Maybe? Yeah, no! Yeah. See? Really? Come on. Don't be like this. You're wasting people's time. I can't even see what that says. Yes! Oh my gosh, that's right. They're the one with the triangle. I keep forgetting. I should have known that just by looking at the shape of the thing. Alright, so let's lay her down. And it doesn't say guess on every single one. Guess, 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 guess. <laughs> I'm not a little derpy. Hmm. Ooh, there's a swirly. Oh, it's a swirly pen, hairpin thingy. Um, barrette. Yeah. I think I have a couple more just like it. There, I think they were somebody's bridal, whatever. Oh, look. It's a little. It's a little toe ring cross. Alrighty. That's weird. <laughs> But then weird isn't a bad thing. Here's a twisty twisty with gold and silver tone. A little bit worn. Here's a piece of. Don't know. Feels like aluminum. Aluminum. Oh wow, we got another knot here, a big knot full of stuff. Ooh, this is a tie around the back of your neck. And it is a little vial full of sand. So this is um, beachwear for show off. I want to buy sand from the beach I visited. Okay, here you go. <laughs> This does not have a name on it. It's cat's eye. 
Ah, look at that. Doesn't have a name. Very, just a very, um, plain little everyday necklace. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ugh. Ugh. Please untangle. Oh, there's one that doesn't want to be in the rest of the mess, does it? Please tell me you're not connected. Oh, too bad they're connected. Which means they're all caught up in... Oh, hey, that's why everything's in a ball. Hold on one moment. It's this. undo all this mess. It's one of these, so we just gotta pull everything off it. Or pull everything, yeah, pull everything off it. So this is one of these guys that you can wear any pendant with. It's a little out of shape, but it's always nice to have one of these in your, uh, in your jewelry box. So that when you have pendants that have no chains, you can just wear them on here and showcase them that way. And they hit, they hit right at your, sh your throat so that ev everybody gets to see them. So there's that. Now let's see if we can't pull some of this apart. We're at 26. Here's a neat one. Uh, I don't know. It's black and silver with rhinestones around it. It's real cute. It's another one of those everyday. It's like a larger pendant on a chain uh, that isn't. Oh, Leah, Leah Sophia. Um, it's not real ostentatious, but it's not so tiny that people don't notice it. You know, that size to me is like your everyday jewelry. That's the kind I like to put with outfits because they're visible, they have color. The little dainty silver and gold ones are, you know, you have maybe one or two that you wear all the time. I don't know, that's just my take on jewelry. You may have a different way of doing things. This is rosary chain pearls and little crosses. Two strand. That's a neat one. Here's one to wear to church, right? I like that. Not that I go to church, but if I were a church goer. Here's an, a vinyl tassel. It's in great shape. Uh, and it's on a chain. And the chain is, oop, let's see. I haven't been measuring everything because I want to get through more. But just if you want to know the lengths on things, just ask me in the comments. This is 25 inches and it is missing a clasp. So that is going into the craft lot. You can also speak to that if you would rather have it not be in the craft lot. This one I think is supposed to have something in the back of it. I think it was one of those ones you put your pic put a picture in, but the back is missing. So that's going also into the craft lot. We're at 29. Here we go with a cute little peach colored enamel or resin, but they're real shimmery. It's pretty and it's got these rhinestones sitting way up high on it. That's cool. I like that one. Cute. It's like a pale orange. Okay. Cute, cute, cute. Ooh, this is one of these. are very long. Ooh. Very long 
very loosely constructed snail chain with it's a purse chain yep but if you would like that kind of chain for crafting that's where it's going and I will leave the craft pile out of the big craft lot until people speak for specific items and generally um, my craft stuff is if you pull it from the craft lot, it's not going to cost you much. Um, oh heck, we're at 30. <gasps> and here's what we have left at 30. Here's an earring, a little cross earring. Uh, I want to thank you all for being here. Please leave a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a comment in the down there. And if you see something you can't live without, Please leave a timestamp in the comments below, or you could send me an email with that timestamp, the title of the video, and the date that it was posted so that I can find the item that you would like. Please remember that I love each and every one of you, and be yourself, because everyone else is taken. Bye-bye.